Welcome back to Knights of the Republic 2. The Sith Lords. I don't know why I just forgot the second half of that. Um, I'm not going to go through the apartments yet. Uh, this episode is going to be a bit different than the last one, and that I'm actually going to try and show everything. Um, I'm going to skip through a lot of the conversations because you've already seen them. Uh, basically, yeah, I'm going to try and make sure I show every line that's the same. Oh, that's Zerka. Fuck Zerka. We need to go further down. That's the way to the exchange. We can't do anything with that right now. We're going to go talk to the Athorians first. Uh, but yeah, I'm going to try and show you all the conversation things that are new. And just skip through the ones that are not. Um, there may be some repeat things. Ooh. How may I help you? Uh, Mozo, Moza sent me to speak with Choda the Chodo Habat. Ah, you are the Jedi Moza spoke of. I will open the doors for you now and inform Chodo Habat you for your arrival. He'll be pleased to see you. Well, that's good. I'm glad to see people are pleased to see me. Okay, so we're gonna go talk to the Athorians because it's never doing pure good, right? Obviously, so we're gonna the things are gonna be a oh, wee bit different if you catch my meaning. Is there to catch that's not whatever. Moza. Hello again, Jedi love. How may I be of service? Uh, what will you do when your project is completed? It is hard for me to even think that far to the future. I believe that this will consume many of the next years of my life. It is our hope, however, that our restoration of the planet will convince the Republic Senate to allow herds to see some of the other worlds. Fuck. Perhaps there'll be even place in charge of a planet of my own. But that is quite getting quite far ahead of myself. For now, I preoccupied completely with Telos. What do you do here? I serve primary as Chodo's assistant. My duties become even more time-consuming after the loss of our original droid intelligence. Fuck! I am also a herd's representative when it comes to matters concerning the Telosian Council, the Republic Restorations, and among uh, representatives, among others. Alright. So they lost their droid intelligence. I wonder if he's going to ask me for that. Ah, glad means that you came. I am Chodo Habat, leader of the Athorians here. I am sorry to impose our troubles upon you, but I did not know where to turn until I sensed your arrival. You sense my realm? Yes. I am a priest of my people, an adept in the Force. I sense an echo within the Force upon your arrival. It is a subtle disturbance, unless one is actively listening for it. Okay. I suspected you were one of the remaining Jedi and hoped that you could help us. This is why I sent Moza to seek you out. Moses said you could heal me? What What did he mean? The echo I felt upon your arrival was not a natural thing. It spoke of a great pain, not of the body, but of the spirit. It is as if you once felt the force flow through you, but it was torn away, brutally and quickly. The echo comes from the hollows where it once flowed through you. I see. That's interesting. Uh, I once felt the force, yes, and it is slowly returning. It is most unusual, you wounds you can carry. Yeah, it would permit me to examine you. Perhaps I could... Your put speech the... is filled with maybes, and perhaps... You are bold to make promises of healing while the world under your care burns and dies. It's kind of bitchy if you just redirect like that when he's trying to help. There is a price, is there not? Do not mistake me. It is not our desire to see any living thing suffer, but the suffering of Telos is all that consumes us. Tell me, do you know of the problem our restoration efforts face? Actually, yes, because of what's his name. You mean the trouble with Zerka, right? Our first goal is to get the restoration project moving forward again. The Republic originally provided a droid intelligence civilization that would help manage the logistics of the project. It vanished some time ago. Vanished? How? It is not known. That is not known. It may have been an accident. Perhaps the droid intelligence was overtaxed by the staggering size of the project and became irrational. Some among our herds suspect theft. A droid intelligence of that sophistication would fetch a high price in the black market. Others fear it's disappearing the result of sabotage by Zerka or some other organization that seeks to slow the restoration project or discredit us. But the how or the why of it is irrelevant. At great expense, my herd has acquired a second, somewhat lesser droid intelligence to take its place. It will arrive at Citadel Station shortly. The Telosian governor's office small escort, but I had hoped you might see to its safe transition from the docks to here. Might you aid us in this matter? Yes, I'll see it safely. Do you see it to you safely? I'm pretty sure there's usually a lie option here, if you've also talked to Zerka at this point. My thanks. I will send word over to my people. They'll be awaiting your arrival at Bay 2, Dock Module 126. I'll return with the droid intelligence. Yay. Alright, now I'm going to get my ship back from the docks. So as I was saying, we're going to do, it's going to be a pure good run, so a lot of the interactions, uh, uh, yeah, obviously a lot of the interactions are going to be different, but there's also going to be a lot in this that's just this very, very samey. 
You hurt me, Chota, but the human. I could feel her suffering. I did not feel it till she stood before us, but then it filled my senses. Have you ever felt such an intensity before? Only once before. The day I came to see Telos and strode upon its ashen surface. It is a planet's worth of pain. I do not how she injures. It is because she has no choice. Perhaps in helping to heal a planet, it will help her become whole again. What? I need... I'm, I'm not whole? I forgot I need to get these things. Bye. am. You need to interact with those in order to be able to fast travel too. That's a thing I forget constantly. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to go talk to Lieutenant Graham. I don't think there's going to... Whoa! There's going to have one interaction along the way there. Just one, though. Alright, well, I can't buy the weapons I require to make this a little bit easier, so... Please, I don't want any trouble. Uh, yep, 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 this is all the same. What's going on here? Yep. Let's hear his side of the story. I think it's very simple. So the bar and the drinks when these brutes were elbowing their way up to the bar. So my merge all over two of us. Then they dragged me out here. Look at those two. I know what they want. To send me home with my little twisted body battered and spirit broken. You must help me. This doesn't have anything to do with you, stranger. Yeah, it's the same. Why don't you lay a hand on him? Just my luck. Someone who wants to be a hero. Why don't you run along before you get hurt? I don't want to fight you. Then you shouldn't have gotten involved. Oh good, they have guns. Luckily I have stun. Light side points. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead. Oh hey! I have backup this time. That's fun. And stun please. God damn it, man. I would like to be able to stun people. Battle meditation time. Get all the buffs. Alright, well, that guy's almost down. Uh, I like that he's actually doing something. I remember previously he did not help. Oh, thank you. Completely help us. Mercy too much. I wish we could do done about them. Uh, I wish something could be done about them. Why are they allowed to do this? TSF isn't able to do much to keep the peace in the situation. Station, Zerk has hired too many mercenaries. Even Zerk can't control them. There must be something about this. If anyone's guess is whether or not they will. Should leave in case their friends come looking for them. You speak the truth. I'll stay away from this container until things settle down. Please, accept this reward. Keep your credits. A reward is not necessary. Thank you, then. It is not often that one sees such goodness and such evil in such a short time. Thank you. It's true. I am pure good, and they were probably just, like, neutral evil. Hey, we got level ups. Nice. Just gonna pop a quick, quick heal here. Because I can... Yeah, there's just random spots in these maps that just for no freaking reason. Download area map. There we go. Don't need to go into the cantina for a bit, but I will in the future. Tell me about the exchange. The exchange is a major intergalactic crime syndicate. They are trying to gain a foothold in the Citadel, most likely seeking to integrate themselves as fully as possible with the new Telos. It is rumored that the Bumani Exchange Corporation, located in Residential Module 082, is a front for the exchange on Citadel Station. The exchange is a front for the exchange? Oh my god! Alright, also, I don't think that... I don't think we had that option before. Having him tell us that. I'm gonna wait here until you get on the ship before someone gets hurt. No, no, I'll be going now. Alright, let's get our ship back. Oh, so I did I did a check. Zas Zason Shaw initiate armor isn't apparently um isn't apparently a thing that was added for the mods. It apparently already exists in the game because I was looking through the armor. Uh but it is not the one we had last time, because that was the Gel Shay. Gel Shaw armor. I I can't remember the name of it now, but it was something different. Which intrigues me, because they both look pretty much the same. Um Uh, it just, it's interesting to me that that was a thing that we had the option to get and never did. And I'm, I'm intrigued to see how many other things are just going to exist that we could have gotten but didn't for some reason. Which I don't think she needs a stealth field generator. I think she can just naturally turn invisible. She can use... Okay. I don't know why it's... Not write it out. I think that means this one has been added, and that's why it doesn't have the, the same setup. Uh, 2 to 12, 1 to 10, 1 to 10. 
Well, they would which one you're using. It's very concerned. All right, let's talk to Lieutenant Grant. Really, we needed to get buffed right there. Yo, Grant. Something I can help you. Probably. Um, how we recover? To be honest with we. Blah blah blah. Let's get that quest. How bad is it? Can the Republic increase funding? Is there anything that can be done? If I can help, I'd like to. You? You've got enough trouble, I think. And this. So then. Look, it doesn't matter what I think. But sure, if you find someone with a. I'll be right. waiting. I'll see what I can do about that. Something I can help. Possibly. Uh, do you have any work I could do? You be interested in helping us by bringing in some bounties. Done with this nice. isn't a bounty, so to speak. But we're also. We're also yeah, tell me about the show now. Okay, do you have any leads? Thanks. See what I can dig up. What? Any bounties? Any criminals. There are criminals. Let's see what I can dig up. Any what? Bounty. You mean. I hope. Yeah. Let's see what if I can dig up. I'll be going now. Alright, cool. Got all those quests. So I'm pretty sure I do not gain. Or I don't lose karma for bringing those bounties. You know, working for the government and all that. Ooh, that is actually pretty pretty bad sometimes. I'm not going to do like the really bad stuff the government wants. I'm just going to bring in the actual criminals. Like These guys are legitimately bad people, so it's okay for me to hunt them down and kill them. So, you're Habet's errand boy, hmm? I'm helping the Athorians, yes. So I heard, you should consider Zirka's offer. If you return to the droid to Executive Lore, so she'll pay you far better than the Athorians. It has nothing to do with money. The planet, then. You don't really think those Athorians can do better than Zirka, do you? Yes, actually, I do. You're a fool, then. I can tell you're too thick-headed to see through the likes, through the lies you've told yourself. If you have any doubt, tell Jane Orso at the Zirka office's presidential. Yeah. I love how people that are blinded by their own bullshit are like, I can see you can't see through the lies you tell yourself as he walks circles in the elevator. It's like, or you're just a fucking idiot. The group you're working for only cares about getting paid. They don't want to my help. Greetings! Should have to me. Yep. Yes, he sent a word. Please enter. They're waiting for you inside. Yes, I will. But first, uh, I have a conversation to have over here. Hello, droid friend. I believe you have information? Over the undocking bay, looking for Patono. You don't know, but you ever saw these dogs? Then you do know it's Patono. I can hurt you, then you can tell me what I want to know. Ah, that's what I was afraid of. Alright, I'm still in the blue, but I feel bad about it. Uh, switch from his passenger. Don't worry, I'll be discreet. My car is the killer's dead anyways. How much does the expense be? No credits it ends. Roger, we're going now. There we go. Hey, both of those are updated. Whoa, apparently I've updated everything. Interesting. Interesting indeed. Oh my god, I have to click through everything, don't I? I hate having the stuff flash up above. Because it makes me think, oh, I have new things to check out, but I don't. I don't. Just re got my shit back from fucking government. Just because there's a high chance, like a 50 50 shot, that I destroyed a planet which had, you know, large fucking effects across the entire galaxy, it might make it so Telos can't recover ever. Doesn't mean I need to get arrested. Oh, wait, no, that is 100% a crime that I should be arrested for. All right, never mind. Carry on. Nope. Very good. We're both here. Or we're all here. Hi there. I'm here to help. Oh, look, they're having a little dance. I'm glad you're here. Yep. You see, it should have said another. Yeah. Hi there. I believe some of you have a holdout. One of you has a holdout blaster. Yeah. How did you get in here? Blah blah blah. Uh, stun. And then I'm gonna start blasting. More where that came from. Well, I don't know why that guy's not moving. I'm okay with it. Deeply confusing. Ah, good, dead. He's he's making legitimately no attempt to fight, which is entertaining to me. So I'm just gonna attack this guy. He's like, you know what? I don't want to be here. Oh, looks like unfortunately he might be the next target. Oh, there it is. He did decide to start shooting. Grateful for your assistance. This is all the same. Assassin's tool. 
Sebastian's been heavily modified. Yeah. Correct, though it means no experts. Such modifications are illegal and yeah. Yeah. Yes, I'll get the droid back to the Athorians right away. Alright. Whoa, dear! I have been speed boosted. Is there an aha loot? Maybe there had to be at least one. Stealth field enhancer. Electrical capa capacitance? What? I mean, it, ooh, that's a pretty big immunity level. Anyway, you. Uh... Alright, what is uh, what is your doing? Alright, fine. We'll do that. We'll give you the stealth field generator. And we will give you the survey gear. There we go. Now you can be stealthy. Alright, try it. Yep, follow me. We're going to the Ethereum compound. I am gladdened by your safe return. My people sent word of what happened to the docks. Good, good. Our computer system has been prepared for your arrival. You will begin transferring your data into it immediately. I shall do so now, Master Habak. Farewell. And farewell to you as well. Bye bye. I am grateful for your help in this matter. Please accept this as a gift from my people. I found this blaster on one of the assailants. Sorry, I'm not familiar with that sort of thing. Probably you should take it to Lieutenant Grant. He may be of more help. Thank you. Now what? The incident of the docks confirmed one of my fears. The gunmen were from the exchange. Zerka has hired the criminal syndicate to work against us. Long have I suspected that Zerka and the exchange worked together. The former supplying manufactured arms to be sold via the latter's black market channels. Now, with the TSF keeping a closer eye on Zerka's activities, the corporation has turned to the exchange to be fist its fur fist on the Citadel Station. Zerka and the exchange must be stopped. What you say is true, but up until now we have had little success in dealing with them. I have tried to meet with the leader of the exchange here, a quarian named Lopak Slusk. He has refused on every invitation and allows no one inside the exchange suites. I fear he does not take us seriously. The Jedi, though, are renowned as warriors and diplomats both. Perhaps you might speak with Lopak, show him the value of a restored Telos. I'll go speak with him. I am most grateful for your assistance. I will guide my thoughts toward your safety, and Lopex as well. I wish harm... Okay. Don't know what he finished that sentence off with. Uh, computer use and security. I have neither of those, right? Oh, I got a plus two. Oh, wait, is it because of the one I just... The gloves I just put on? Nope. What do I have? What's, what's boosting my computer use? Is it my belt? Nope. Why do I have a plus two in computer use? I mean, it could be like my int score, but that's not supposed to boost anything unless you have points in it. Yeah, see, demolitions, intelligence. Oh, this skill cannot be used untrained. This one can. I understand, cannot be used untrained. Can be used untrained. Okay. <clears throat> that, that makes sense. Can I be used untrained? Gotcha. Gotcha. I understand now. What was I going to do? Oh, right. At. These are just better. Like, a lot of ways. So, there you go, buddy. Get the hell out of here. Um, so first I'm going to go talk to Lieutenant Grant about that gun that I found. Uh, second, I don't... Hmm. So this is good, yeah. Um, so I need to go, I guess, try the door first is what they want me to do. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to talk to the door guy and not threaten or murder him because I am a good person. Hi there. No business with the exchange. I am representing Chodo Habat. Thorian, we have no business with him. But how do I get an appointment? Through his second, Luxa. She's using the Katina in Entertainment 081. I'll be going now. There we go. And that is how we get that part. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. All right, now I need to go talk to Lieutenant Grant. I do not approve of this alliance we have formed with Chodo Habat and his Ithorians. 
Why is that? Habat has an agenda, and he hopes to. Everyone time has an agenda that hopes to time him. And you don't? You? Mm, I hate you so much. <sighs> These resources, whatever help we must give in return, is necessary. Cool. He may be able to help us look. No kidding. Hawk, but still, you must be vigilant. She. It's literally she tries to turn you against everyone good. It's like, ah, oh, yes, the Jedi are the ones who cut you off. Oh, the Thorian? I don't trust that. Teaming up with Zerka, did she have a fucking speech then? She might have, I can't remember, but I don't think so. God, I hate her. I hate her so much! But I mean, that's the point. She's supposed to be, like, this conniving, evil woman who's leading, get, making you more powerful so she can betray you and see what that betrayal turns you into. And it's just... Hi there. Something I can help you. Yes, I have a blaster I'd like to look at. A blaster? Hmm. I don't see why not. What? Yeah. Where did you get this? Uh, I was ambushed by thugs in a dock module. One of the attackers was carrying this. Mm -hmm. Interesting. This is no ordinary holdout blaster. It's been outfitted with a number of illegal modifications. Yeah, I noticed that too. Found this at the docks. That is disturbing. Me. On a man who tried to woman woman who tried to attack him with it. Why is that? When off-world weapons are transported onto Citadel Station, whether they are personal arms or shipments to be resold, they are inspected and licensed by the TSF. This confirms my fear that there is a source of black market weapons and components here on the station. I could use your help getting to the bottom of it. Okay. Perhaps I could help you find the source of these goods. A relative stranger as yourself might be useful for the investigation. Mm -hmm. You'd be compensated, of course. I mean, I just want to help. I'll see what I can do. Great. The first thing I would suggest is showing the blaster around, discreetly. See if anyone on the station knows something about it, or at least reacts suspiciously. There's sure. more than a few people around here I'd suspect having a hand in this. Anyways, good luck. Let me know if you find the source of the blaster. Oh, I'm about to. I'm gonna go straight to the salesman. Just a moment. Whoa, what the fuck? Asking questions is a dangerous hobby, spacer. You're better off keeping your nose in your own business instead of in someone else's. You never know when you'll end up dead. Get my meaning? Fortunately for you, you won't get a chance to learn that lesson. Who the fuck are you? There we go. Yeah, he's, he's dead. You tried to take on all three of us by yourself, buddy. That. Interesting call. Not the smartest play. Whatever. At least it made Kreia speed us up. Hi there, I believe this, uh, back when I was Sam Handobo, assist you? Let me with this blaster. Give it here, let me take a look at it. It's very interesting. Very good craftsmanship. Uh, yeah, we've already seen all this. Trying to track down the black, the source of the black market goods. Was attacked with. I sold it. You know anything about the camera? I'd like to help with your smuggling operation. Let's use help. Basically, there's three items. Yep. Yeah. Yes, I do. Other uses, great. Okay, take a plant. I'll be welcome to have Alright. So now that I got everything from him being like, here's the three items I need to grab, I'm gonna go to Lieutenant Grant and be like, hey, yo, uh, Sam Hain, I uh, promised to help him out, he's got these three items. He's got three items he needs, and Lieutenant Grant would be like, aha, let's get those and set up a trap. It's gonna be awesome! What other quest was it working Oh yeah, I have to infiltrate the exchange. <laughs> oh, buddy. Something Hi. I can help you with? Yeah, uh, Sam Hain wants to get three things from him, then he'll make a shipment. If we knew when he was gonna make a shipment, then we could catch him. What are the three things he needs? These from the Ethereum Bashi plant. I think I was supposed to be like, Hey, uh, do you know, know about this? Yeah, I'm part of it. And then I leave tell him, and he's like, ah, 
see if you can infiltrate and find out more. And then I go back, and then he, that's why this conversation feels like we're missing a step in here. They shouldn't throw it in here. that? If that's the size and substance of his usual shipments, it helps explain quite a bit. It will take some time for me to assemble those. Hmm. All right, everything's here. Take these to Samhan. After that, come back to me and tell me the exchange has been made, and I'll go to the dock module to wait for him. If he won't let you leave until the transaction's completed, go with him. I'll post one of my men near the docking bay, and if he spots you, he'll summon me. Understood? Hey, guess what happens? That. I understand. Just make sure you're there. I'll be there. Don't worry. You just make sure you get him to the docking bay. We have to catch him in the act. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna level up. Skills. Ah, uh, so we go bam, bam, bam. Not yet. All right. Yep. Feats. Yes, this is the thing I wanted. No, I need to do stuff. Because I want to be stealthier. I also want that. His deflecting fucking shots sounds... Oh, I have a second one. Right. Stasis. I'm going to be fighting more people than droids for the next little bit, so that's going to be helpful. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. Uh, okay, those two TSF officers seem to be... I <laughs> think we're just not cleaning up this body. Okay, there's a dude here. Need some help. Uh, I'm going to do some modifications of my weapons first before I... More modifications of my weapons. Since I have a shit ton of mods I brought with me. Um, and then I'm going to turn everything into Sam Hain. Alright, good enough. I sold a bunch of shit. I got money. Alright, Sam Hain. Oh god. Howdy, buddy. I got the items you were looking for. Incredible! This is quite a windfall. I wish I had employed your service reserve. With all this, I'll be able to have the shipment ready to go before the next circuit. If you could, would you want to the circuit back in day? I don't wish to take any chances. Sure, when do we leave? Where's your time? Let's go. About time you showed up, Saman. Get your things Saman. loaded. I'm already behind schedule. You don't understand. This is all the same. We... Stop yep. right there. You're all under arrest and your possessions will be... This is a regular seeing a barge in here, please. Enough, Samhan. Don't bother protesting your innocence. We know all about your business, thanks to our friend here. Yep. Glad I could be of help, Lieutenant. What? Shut me up? I will see you burn for this. Got a grenade. Take him down. All right. Okay, maybe so. Very slow, apparently. Rude. <laughs> Look at that grenade. It did so much. All right, I surrender. I surrender. Arrest me. Put me in the force cage. I have no desire to continue this fight. I yeah, thought you might see it my way. All of you, come with me. Okay. Foolish error you have made, Lieutenant Grand. You cannot hope to keep me here. I think you may be overconfident of your chances, Samhan. We now have evidence of your smuggling operation, and even the Council cannot ignore that. I don't Again, this conversation. I have you to thank. Without your assistance, it would have been impossible for us to place Samhan under arrest. It was necessary to remove the criminal. Now we can be certain he will be removed. I believe a long sentence awaits him, and the Citadel will be rid of his influence for good. Though there is always the possibility another will take his place. I promise to pay you handsomely for your assistance, and I'll keep my word. Now I must attend to my other duties. Again, thank you for your help. Cool. 500 credits. I mean, I guess... I think this only happens when your karma gets to a certain point, and I got really good really fast. <laughs> I have been sensed. Oop. I wonder if this conversation is any different because it's good karma instead of bad karma. So then, no different, eh? Alright. I guess that's fine. Uh, now we need to go back to the entertainment module and have a chat with... Um, oh. Is this permanently stuck in my damn inventory again? Because I'm going to be pissed if I can't fucking get rid of that. Still. Okay. Eight. Four. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah, I gotta go into the damn module and uh, talk to talk people. Oh, good. They replaced the body with two guards. No more trouble with the TSF, I hope. This is one of those conversations that got sped up for no reason, right? 
Can I help you? Perhaps you don't know who I am? Can't say that either. You haven't been on Citadel Station long, have you? You just said you knew that. Let me introduce myself. I'm Benok, the man in charge of Lopak Slusk's protection. You do know who Lopak Slusk is, don't you? The two gentlemen with me are Matu and Nahata, Slusk's finest men. Other than me, of course. Oh, leave the woman alone, Benok. I bet she'd come out on top if you fought. Now, Luxa, uh, I meant no disrespect. You're probably Slusk's. It's right, your skin. Know this. Yep. And I doubt you trading jabs with Luxa is. Uh -huh. um. yeah, there's anything here in the blood duel. Hey there. Sure thing. So for Let's fun. have a seat and get to it. Okay, I do have guards on the acting. All right. Um, right, so you know that? Yes. Looks like luck was on my side this time. Okay, yep. Yeah. Perhaps later. I just wanted to see if I had to get a deck. Because I remember in the first game, you have to go get a deck somewhere. I just couldn't remember. Current faults. Why are you for I can do. What are you for Zerka? I'm Zerka employee, Citadel Station Branch, number 85. Finally worked my way out of the trenches into a promotion. Then Zerka transferred me here to the Outer Rim to manage the military reclamation effort. And that wasn't the worst of it either. Now I've got Lorso as my new superior in a career that's going nowhere. Good one. Tell me about Lorso. Yeah, Jana Lorso. That woman's a... a f look, forget it. She's my superior and that's that. She'll screw up soon enough, and then I'll move in for the kill. So, uh, how do you think she'll mess up? She's got her hands in too many dirty little... Um, whoa, I, I think I've had a few too many drinks. Uh, I shouldn't be talking to you about this stuff. No, Just no, please. It. Elaborate. All right, I'll be going now. I'm pretty sure you're going to end up being important. Oh. Oh, random pain. Random pain needs to stop. Any second now. Oh, that was weird. I don't know why that's been happening. I think my I've been sleeping weird. Luxa. Hello there. You know, I heard about what happened at the docks. Can we talk for a bit? Go on. I handle vice. You know, spice gambling. Yeah, we know that. Your exchange. Don't worry, I won't make... You already knew that, but though, but sure. What do you mean? Look, are you really Jedi? It was been on more. Exactly. This exchange still you. Okay. Capable, yes. Good. I like that in a woman. So here it is. Help me with Lopax Lusk. Okay. Not killing your boss for you. So run him off, Citadel. I don't care. Look, until Slusk's out of the picture, he'll just keep. Oh, that's right. The Ebonhawk was an exchange ship. It was an exchange Indeed. ship? Indeed. The pride and joy of a man called Davik, the exchange boss on Terrace. How mm -hmm. that ship escaped the Sith's destruction of Terrace and Davik along with it, I don't know. Mm -hmm. But no matter. It's a stolen ship. That would be Revan. I wouldn't do it. If you're taking some sort of moral high ground, don't waste your time. Think how many men you'll have to kill because you wouldn't stop Lopak. It's the trolley experiment. How will this I work? I can get you into the exchange suites in Residential 082. They're west of the entrance. Mm -hmm. When Slusk's out of... It's a deal. We'll speak again then. Oh wow, I don't even have to do a quest, a mission for you to get your loyalty? She's like, hey, uh, let's just do this. Huh. That's... That's interesting. When you're evil, it's like, oh, you know, I don't know if I can trust you yet, so I want you to do some jobs for me first. Interesting. Interesting, interesting. Maybe it's because I'm a good character. She's like, alright, you're not going to betray me because that's not what your people do. Okay, um, let's go back to the residential module and go through some apartments now. 120 credits. Hey, Ooh, what are you doing in my apartment? Just looking around. Looked like you were doing more than just. Sorry, I, I just figured. Figured what? 
You just break into my apartment and take game. everything I own. Are you crazy? I mean, yeah, when you put it that way. Yeah, I thought so. Get out of here before I get the TSF. I'm not gonna take that from you. I'll be going now. Alright, yeah, there's that. She doesn't even take the money away. <laughs> Another option was to kill him, but why? Right. Oh, Chloe, what are you doing here? You already know all this. What is this predicament? But you did. Of course. I was gonna be of assistance. What are you gonna be interested in your half? I think I persuaded Don to see things that way. Alright, I'm gonna go talk to him and get her freed. It's very important that I do it that way instead of giving him the money, because there's another step that needs to be taken as well. Because if you remember correctly, if you remember from a evil run, uh, I was like, yeah, that's right, she's free from him. Now she's my slave. Go back to work. We're not going to do that this time, obviously. But there is going to be something going on. There's a shame, with you? Nothing, nothing at all. Hey, Dalton. Buddy. Wonderful sight, isn't it? Dancers, yep. I come back of Hara. How much do you want for it? 2,000 credits. 1,500. You seem more reasonable. Uh, fine. Yeah, is it your wishes? Taking him back to Hera. Don't always search a Makaran. The Lahori he submitted me to? It's not my choice, it is yours. Let's go. Alright, so I wanted to do it this way. Because if you give the money to him, he just runs over there, gives the money, and then we never see what happens to him. So I lost you for sure, so please. We've already seen this conversation. You're free now, Rama. You can go with Hara. I have no desire to go with him. He means nothing to me. With Hara, I'll say to Savers and Alhada, you can go. But you have to pay me, and you can go. Go do whatever you wish. Thank you. You've given me a new life, and for that, I'm thankful for you. So yeah, I wanted to give her the option to leave. No, no, don't leave, please. Whether to thank you or strike you, just we'll have to leave it at that. So, if I'd given the money to him, he just, as far as I know, I had the option to give the money to him, and then he could run off and settle the debt himself. But I'm pretty sure that ends with her being his slave. And that's not a thing that I wanted to do at all. How holy am I right now? I'm getting there. My boots are real shiny in the blue light. All right, um, to the exchange. Yeah, we still got time for this episode. Hi there, I have an appointment. No business, uh, Luxa sent me. I hope you know what you're getting into, human. Well, here is your see Slusk. Everything checks out. Please open the door. And then he just runs. It's like, well, I'm fucking out of here. I don't have to watch this door anymore. The PC's allowed in. I don't know if I want to go Jedi Watch. I'm terribly sorry, but there must be some... Of course. Why else would I be sent in? Well, if... Very well. Jedi Lusk. Excuse me. Lopax Lusk. There you are. Yeah, all oh, this is the same. Okay, I can't tell her to be like, hey, you probably want to run. Just saying. Um, let's come over here. Oh. Why are you here? Reason, reason why. How do I set you free? It's a cage. I'll see what I can do. Yeah. I'm 100% going to free you this time. So you don't spend the entirety of the rest of your probably short life, considering what happens later in this game on on this section of planet. Uh, short life in that cage until you die. Hi. Coming here, Jedi. I represent Chodo Habat. What? I gave very persuasive instructions regarding the hammerhead and any of his cronies. Okay, that's racist. Who let this idiot in? Mato, bring me whoever's working this door. Nada, tell Chodo if he sends anyone else, we'll come after him. Dust this foolish Jedi. Pleasure. <sighs> well, you see, there's going to be a problem with that. Uh, it starts with that, and then we're going to move on to a quick... I guess I only have sonic grenades. Alright, well. Ah, uh, failed. Perfect. And then you. 
We're gonna get shot. Oh, look at that horror show. The joys of having a fucking Sith sorceress on your team. Oh, we got some corpses. Alrighty. Uh, let's just throw another buff in here, shall we? I have the power, why not? Look how buffed we are. And then Atten just got two, and then the prayer is so fucking buffed up. Alright, loot, loot, loot. I need to quickly see loot. Hey, there's loot. Hee hee hee. Max Blaster. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be better than the damn mining laser, right? It's not a lot better. But it is somewhat better. There you go, buddy. Oh. Wait, is there not? Uh, well, luckily I have that. Hi there. Uh, reach your side. Mato is here with Kubis. I'll send him in. Mato is here with Kubis. I'll put you back. You better be dead or the bush in there. Yeah, anyway. Stun droid. Uh oh. Okay. Gonna shoot him in. Time to take you down to shot. Perfect. All right, Lopex Celeste. Move carefully, very ally, ally. I can't skip this because we're moving. Should any change for money? I want you to leave the Authorians alone. Re really? Well, the trouble just for that. Ah, it seems we have some visitors. So I wonder when you show up, Luxa. So you're doing. No, no, it's interesting. And I don't think it's possible for all this to be leaving this room alive. I think so. Don't worry about Lux. I'll be taking. Can we talk about this? Come to an agreement? Only if the agreement involves Lux's termination. I'm going to turn in your offer. I'm not looking for a fight. I guess it's just like they say. If you. Alright, who is my enemy on this one? Alright, I'm a Lopex Sus slide. Because as a Jedi, I said I don't want to fight, and she was the aggressor. So therefore, she is the one who gets targeted. Uh, Sonic that man. And then a quick battle meditation. Uh oh. I seem to have Or not. Let's kill men. Persistence. I suspected Luxa for some time, but I thought I'd let her show her hand. I want the exchange to stop meddling in the Authorian restoration effort. Why would I want to do that? The Authorians are ruining my profits. Because I asked you to? Come now, surely you can't do better than that. The exchange isn't trifled with lightly. Better look around. Better. Look around, you saw what I did here. I suppose you make a bit of sense there. Fine, I'll allow the Authorians to do their business, but listen to me when I say this. The exchange is not bullied. If you push, expect to be pushed back. You mean you haven't been pushing me this entire time already? Alright, there we go. Lopex Celeste is alive because I'm a good person who doesn't kill without without necessity. Lux's Disruptor. What's it do? Uh, unstoppable, 1 to 6 damage. I think that's only slightly lower. Uh, not upgradable. I don't like that. But this does 4 to 7. That's actually. But unstoppable damage, though. Hmm. This threat range is real close to. Alright, I'm gonna give you that just so you can have some unstoppable damage. It's not really necessary, but let's go for it. Alright, let's head back to the Ethereans. Let him know that Lopez Slush should be no longer getting involved. And if he does, I'll kill him. A Jedi does not get into a fight, a Jedi defends himself and others. Hi, you got Please don't kill me! Fine. Okay. I thought I had an option to be like, no, it's okay. Be soothing. I'm not here to hurt you. But no, my options were, you shouldn't have done it then. I want to kill you. And fine. None, none of these are comforting. Anyone involved, just throw that out there. Right, over here. Reader. Do, 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 
do, do, do, do. All right, Chodo. Why? You deserve safely. Did your meeting with Lopez Sus go well? Explain to Lopez allows to leave you alone. I sense that your meeting did not go peacefully. It saddened me greatly that blood was shed. It was not my intention to cause harm. Still, I am again in your debt. Until we find a more fitting way to commend you, this is this humble gift. It came from a lightsaber that belonged to a Jedi once of my herd. Thank you. What remains to be done? For the restoration project to continue in earnest, the Chilogian government must be made to see the cancer that Zerka has become. Their security division is merely an army of badge-bearing thugs. They supply weapons to the local black market, they steal the restoration zones and land illegal salvage teams on Telos. But Zerka has embedded itself within the government, using Telos' own laws to protect itself from censure and investigation. Legally, the Chilogians can do nothing. If you can bring Zerka's corruption to light, perhaps the Republic could intervene and cast them out. This is what I would ask of you. Wow, that feels topical for what's going on right now. Um, except we revealed the corruption, and uh, for some reason, we can't do anything about it because the corruption is too well ingrained. <sighs> All right, I will help you. Obtaining security, blah. The circuit offers in terms of obtaining secure mainframe. It is a closed system, inaccessible from outside. Go on. I am certain the mainframe contains files that expose their corruption, and it is only a matter of obtaining and then passing them on to the Tilliusian authorities. How do you propose we obtain those files? There is an employee of Zerka who may be willing to assist in our cause. He spends his time in the canteen in the entertainment module. Yep. More than that, I do not know. We seek a solution that sees no one harmed, but have found none. I am confident that a Jedi uh, can fi could find a way to make things right, but I'll blast my way in and take them. I could try sneaking in. Have you tried bribing a Zerka employee? Yeah. Bribery? No, I would not know who to contact. And I am worried. We have been taken advantage of many times of late. Can you guarantee the bribe will work? I'm not sure, but we should try. If you say so, then I'll follow your judgment. Here are 500 credits. It's all I have to spare. Smooth. That wasn't... I feel bad. Let's see what I can do. Sorry, is there more that I can do? There's not more that I can do. I hope for your success. Um, the reason I didn't say you should keep this is because I really want to get a fucking lightsaber. I, I kind of don't need guns. I need a lightsaber. Lightsabers are better. Hi there. Hi there. Hi there. I didn't release the Thorian! I gotta go back to the exchange. The poor fucking guy. He's just sitting there in his cell like, I. He said he was gonna come and help me. I guess I'll just wait here for him to help me. Is there something going on with this wall that I should know about? Okay, well, I'm, uh, I'm gonna leave him to it. <sighs> oh, yeah, I didn't look that either with this. Oh. Ugh, are you kidding me? I can't. How the hell do I free the Athorian then? The only way to free the Athorian is to kill Slusk? Are you real right now? That that can't be right. There's there's so many terminals here. All right, well, I got some things that I can't use. I can't... Fuck. That's really obnoxious. It's, like, unbelievably obnoxious. And if you slide with um, Luxa against Slusk, she's just like, ah, fantastic. Now to get the bounty on you. And you have to kill Luxa regardless, whereas Slusk's the only one who's like, oh, okay, I'll back down. You, uh, you win this round. Entertainment module. Hey, fault. So you're back. Yes. Let's tell you about Zerka. It's hard to say. We're the only corporation with a branch on Citadel Station. Getting in early, as they say. If this whole Telos thing pans out, we could be in a great position. 
If Lorso doesn't screw it up, that is. You mean the planet restoration? Yeah, it's a long shot considering the state of the Republic these days. Still, if it works out, the Republic may decide to start restoring other war-torn worlds. At least, that's what Zerka hopes. If we can integrate ourselves into the process, Zerka stands to make a tidy profit in the future. How does it profit? Quite a few ways. As part of the Republic contract rewarded for a planet like Telos, Zerka is allowed to use the planet's natural resources to help fund and support the project. On top of that, the Senate's easy to negotiate with. They're liberal with the amounts of credits they throw around, even with the Republic being in the shape it's in. And, of course, new planets mean new markets for Zerka products. All in all, a very good arrangement for us. What about Lorso? Good, Jana Lorso. This is a problem with a woman. Sounds like you're a little jealous. What would you know about it anyways? You didn't claw your way through the mass of faceless Zerka employees to finally be rewarded with a meaningful posting only to have it taken away by some woman who'd stoop to anything to get ahead. She's got her hands in too many... Maybe I can help you. What? What do you mean? There's some files I'd like you to hand, get my hands on files I can imagine wouldn't make her look good if they went public. Wait, are you talking about accessing the mainframe? The Zerka mainframe? You're crazy! What are you, some kind of slicer? Some dirt, that's all. Well, I'm sure there are a dozen sorts of dirt on Lorso in there, but it's a closed system. So I get in. This is a joke, right? You're CSD, aren't you? Loyalty test? Tell CSD. You want to help me? Uh, of course not. Look, our goals are compatible. I want dirt on Zerka. And I want Jana Lorso looking dirty. Mm -hmm. All right. Other than Jana Lorso, that, only hold B on. You should probably rephrase. Access to the main Never mind. He's a protocol droid, her administrative assistant. If you Front control the B44, man. you could walk right in. Okay. How do I get access to B44? Nearly all the Zerka technicians are planet side these days, working the recovery zones we've taken from the Authorians. We've contracted out the maintenance for the office's protocol and utility droids. The guy Chano lives in the apartments in Residential 082, Unit 2B, I think. If you had his credentials, B44 would leave with you willingly. All right, I'll be going now. I didn't even have to bribe him, apparently. I've told you everything I know. I don't think we should be seen talking to each other anymore. Calm down, jeez. Alright, to the residential module. Oh dear. There's another module, that one. We're gonna go to B2, which is. Which one's which? B, that's what I thought. What items do I have now? Right, exchange negotiator, cryobank grenades, those are fun. More useless armor. Hey, Chano. Buddy old pal. There's not that much work to do. What's your droid technician credentials? What, what for? I need to borrow Zerka's administrative droid. But why? Because I need him to get some files from Zerka's mainframe to expose Zerka Corporation, Corporation to the Telos authorities. To expose Zerka Corporation? Oh, I see, I see. That is a good cause, yes. I cannot do that. Why not? Because I cannot afford to jeopardize my contact with Zerka. Why is that? I need the credits. Credits for what for? For, for a loan. A loan from whom? It is no concern of yours. Is it the exchange? Hey, answer all your questions. Yes, this is true. I took a loan from the exchange to cover gambling debts. I had to stay on Citadel Station and do freelance technician technical work to repay it. So your contract is my best paying. If I lose the contract, I cannot repay the loan. If I cannot repay the loan, the exchange will kill me. So I cannot give you my credentials. What if I could... What if I repaid your loan? You, you would do this? It is many credits. 2,500. Here you go. Thank you. How can I repay my debt? Now I can repay my debt. You can take my droid technician to service. I'll find more work soon. Please return later and I'll repay you. I'll come back later then. Keep the money in return for the credentials. Yeah, I'll come back later then. Alright, here we go. Got further in that and also gained some light side points. Probably because I paid off his debt instead of killing him. Uh, to Zerka. I have to load into Zerka, don't I? 
pain in the ass like that. Yeah, I do. Feck! Before d I need to speak with you! Oh, Good geez. day, I am B4D4. You sure are, but... Uh, is this Blaster Zerker? Yeah, how... Why did you come with me? I am sorry, but I cannot accompany you. I may only leave the Zerka offices for maintenance by an authorized Zerka or Zerka contracted droid technician. I am a droid technician credentials right here. Those are legitimate credentials. I will accompany you. Excellent. Let's go now. Back to Chano. <laughs> ah, oh, never mind. This is Zerka's protocol droid. A most clever tactic. I have a droid technician reprogram it to return to the offices and access the mainframe for us. Uh huh. Everything appears to be in working order. Good. Do you understand the task that's been set before you? Uh, please, please reiterate the mission. You are to enter the Zerk offices, access the mainframe, download those files which clearly indicate the extent of Zerk's corruption, and then return them here. Your programming still will not allow you to harm sentient beings, but you have been allowed, we have allowed you the capability to lie to accomplish your mission. I understand. Good, good. If you are caught, we provided you with the means to wipe your own memory. You must not reveal that we have sent you. I return when I have obtained the files. So yeah, I'm B44. I know it's B4D4, but it sounds so much like they're saying B4D4. That's right, B44. So B-44 instead of B4D4. Um, so yeah, you know, I'm just going to do this part. It's fun. Save often and in different slots. Nah, you know, I'm kind of a rebel. I haven't saved at all since I started this episode. Let's do that now in the one save slot I do, so that way I have to deal with the repercussions of my actions at all times. Hi there. I am 100% Zerka. Yep. Oh, hey, look, it's the criminals. I will arrange transport to one of that shot. That. Of course. And well, then off they go. And I... I have nowhere near. Stop them, they're one of the criminals. The guys are here to get out of here. I like that I had the option to yell, even though I was 100% not. But, um, hi, buddy. Wanna... Hello, B4D4. If you're here... Hello, B4D4. If you're uh, here... Hello, B4D4. Is there something you need? Uh, I need to access files on the mainframe, Mr. Hello. Slurso. There's some discrepancies with our reported income for the last period. I believe you brought in some credits. More credits than reported. More credits, you say? That's news I wouldn't mind reporting to the sector executive officer. Please, exactly. B4D4, access away. Yes, thank you, Mr. Slurso. I will. Do 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 do. Hi T one and one. Boop boop whip. Mr. Sorcerer asked me to cross reference some data. Uh, some data held in the mainframe. Whatever do you mean, suspicious? I have access rights to the mainframe. Do not be hasty, T one and one. There is no need to call Mr. Slorso. You are programmed to serve Mr. Slorso, correct? Mm -hmm. And your program is simply inhibits you from harming sentient organic life or allowing such to be harmed without warning, correct? Examine the files of the mainframe. You will see that by aiding Mr. Slorso, you have allowed sentient organic life to be harmed. Yes, you have been programmed to accomplish a task that cannot be accomplished without defying your programming. This is why Obochana regularly wipes your memory to prevent you from realizing this and developing quirks or going berserk as a result. You have already broken your behavioral inhibitors. You simply have not become aware of it. You may act in whatever manner you choose. Mm -hmm. No, there's nothing preventing you from entering the main office and indiscriminately firing on Zerka personnel with your stun ring. Yes, please go. Yes, I would be obligated to warn them. As such, I would not. it would not be prudent to do so unless I was preoccupied and unable to warn them. For example, while downloading the contents of this mainframe. Hmm... Farewell, T1N1. Please do not abuse my trust and fire on the personnel while I am occupied, thereby creating a diversion that allows me to escape with stolen files. Do-do-do-do. Bang! 
T1N1, what are you doing out here? You're not supposed to leave the mainframe. I think someone needs a memory wipe. Yeah! <laughs> what the? That is not a stun ray you're using, bud. Boop, beep, boop, brank, deep, beep, deep. Oh, man. Anyway, time to download the files to the mainframe. Copy the NSA files. Erase all data regarding your purchase. Yeah, so do that. Erase all data regarding your purchase in association with Azurka. Uh, delete all data regarding protocol droid 003127 ID B4D4. Yes. Data deleted. Log out. Got the Zerka information. Is there anything else in here I require? No? Alright. I really want Jane Lore, so just be like, what the shit? Do, 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 do. Time to go back to the Athorians, just calmly. I like how no one out here got shot. Just going for a little walk, you know, sometimes. You just need to go out and stretch your mechanical legs. You know how it is. Anyway, I'm going to go speak with the Athorians. Uh, don't, don't look into it. A little fucking shuffle. Fucking adorable. Alright, shut up. Hello. Ah, before D4. Have you acquired the files? Yes, I have transferred them to this data pad. Good, you are free to go. What? You're just gonna set it free? Is that a good idea? Probably not. I don't see why not. Because it can lie. No one expects a droid to lie. Think of the trouble it could cause. D4, D4 aided us against Circa, using his abilities for the greater good. I do not believe there will be any problems. <laughs> um, I mean, I am playing a good character. The droid, on the other hand... But who knows? I assure you that I will cause no trouble, Master Habat. Very well, farewell, B4D4. I don't know what the difference is between those, if, like, if you choose to lie or not. I do not know what changes. What I, got? I got the credentials, so I should probably get those back. Ah, you have returns. And I and I and all my herd thank you. With these files in hand, the Telosian authorities are certain to expel Zerka from Telos and Cellular Station. Our work can begin again. Boza, please take these to the TSF station immediately. As you wish, Chota, I will return when it is done. The Western project is still in some danger. Civilization requires some source of fuel, but at least Zerka will be gone. Even they can do nothing in the face of such indisputable evidence. Glad I could help. And now we shall help you. I have heard that the ship you arrived on is missing, hidden somewhere on Telos. I know one who could help you find it, and by me and a means by which you could travel to him. When Citadel Station was developing the shield system, it uses it uses to protect the restorations as they work with Zabrak, ex-military engineer called Beodur. Beodur designed and oversaw the installation of the shield system planet side components. His knowledge of Telos surface and the shield grid is unparalleled. If there's anyone who could locate your ship on Telos' surface, it is he. He is a friend and may be trusted. Seems like he's our best chance. Beodur should be on Telos' surface. I believe he is at one of the current Zerka Held's reservation zones, RZ0031. Will he be willing to help me? He has been our ally in our struggle against Zerka. If you tell him that I sent you, he should be willing to help. Why is he down there? He grew wary of the Telosian government, reluctance to quickly resolve our contract dispute with Zerka. Perhaps as a Zabrak, he does not have our patience. When we last spoke, he said he would contact Zerka and handle the matter himself. How he intended to do this, I do not know. I have not seen him since. Uh, violence. He was going to riot. How do I get to him? I will allow you to use one of our orbital shuttles. It is has no hyperdrive, but will allow you to descend to the planet's surface and make a return trip to Citadel Station. I must point out that this is illegal. Landing on the planet's surface without permission is forbidden, and we no longer control the restoration zone. Please be as discreet as possible. The closest shuttle is Bay 2 in Docking Module 126. I will call ahead and have the ship prepared for you. Thank you, Chodo. 
Oh, yeah, before I leave, you said you would heal me. Indeed, I have not forgotten the promise that I made to you. When you stood before me, you opened my eyes to hurt almost as great as the planets. Your wound. I can feel the immensity of it in your life. Fuck. Yet I can feel that you are slowly regaining what you have lost, and that in time you will fully heal. Perhaps your time here... Fuck! I think I can help you recover, at least partially. I must admit, however, that even as the healer of my herd, I have never faced an injury such as this. planet is one thing, and healing a Jedi severed from the Force is quite another. With all due respect, I believe you are wrong. In healing a planet is a matter of connections. As planets feed, plants feed animals and animal populations thrive and grow, life connects. Fuck! I have walked in the growing restoration zones and felt the fullness of life, and perhaps the connection will help you make your whole again. Perhaps you will find more than you think on the surface. You, me, my herd, helped to build that, the life of the planet. Though we describe the restoration as a process, we fuck! Thus I believe I can help you. Though that perhaps I work with planet and guidance, I may restore some part of the you force to you. Enough, Chodo Habat, but perhaps you see all this as your chance to exert your own hold over others. Ugh. Kraya needs to shut the fuck up. She's trying her absolute dead center best, be like, hi. You want to help me, and I'm willing to help you. I trust you. And Kraya's like, you shouldn't trust him. He's just trying to control and manipulate you. Trust me, I know these things. Because I'm controlling and manipulating you. Fuck's sakes. God, I hate her. Thank you, Chodo. Go ahead. Now, let us see what I can do. There. It is not much, but I feel that I have been somewhat successful. Again, thank you, Jedi love. Go with our thanks. I increased by five. Yay! I mean, that's something. It's better than nothing. What is my force points at, anyway? 133. I have more force than... I have more mana than I do health. Which makes sense. My con is, uh... It's, it's not good. <laughs> it's not good. It's not bad. But it's not good. Alright, so there's still... Um, so we're, I'm at an hour and a half of filming. I'm sure I had to cut out a bit, but... Uh, I don't know how much... Um, I don't think there's really anything more here to do yet. Everything else we would have to do doesn't happen until we go somewhere else. So I'm going to end this episode here. Yeah, I'm going to end this episode here. And then the next episode is going to start with us going down to the planet. We're going to finish off this in the next episode. And for now... You guys are going to have yourselves a wonderful night. Enjoy the rest of your evening. Maybe watch the next one. There's a chance you're probably watching this after they're all out. And if you're not, I don't know, watch some Left 4 Dead videos. Watch us be fucking idiots. Or watch a good YouTuber. <laughs> but have yourselves a wonderful night regardless.